Hello everyone. Now let us see about leveling. Leveling is all about vertical distance. So here what we try to do is we try to determine the elevation between two points usually or try to determine the elevation of a single point with respect to another point. Like let us say we want to determine the elevation difference on the ground. It is like this. Like you have point A here. Then you have point B here. And you want to know the elevation difference. Like this difference you want to know the vertical separation between point A and point B. So that you can do with the help of leveling. So what we usually have is we have a telescope fitted on to a tripod and the one which is commonly used is known as dumpy level and at these both points we have we ask a surveyor to hold a hold a staff vertically. So this is known as a leveling staff which will have readings on it. So as you can see you, can, you are having 1 meter, 2 meter, 3 meter and 4 meter readings in this leveling staff. You sight this staff through this telescope. Before that you have to make sure that this dumpy level whatever it shows has a horizontal line of sight and from there you sight this point and you will have a reading on the staff. So here it starts from 0 to let us say this comes out as S1 meters. And then you take the leveling staff here and again try to hold it vertically and make sure we have to hold it vertically otherwise there will be again errors because when you hold it inclined it will show a different reading. So we have to make sure that the leveling staff is held vertical and again you stand here and try to sight this point. So again from 0 to this point you will have a reading let us say that is S2. So from these two readings you can clearly know the elevation difference between B and A. So here the elevation difference between B and A is clearly S1 minus S2. So this is your S1 and this is your S2 and this is your elevation difference. So elevation difference between B and A is S2 minus S1. So this is about relative elevation difference between two points. And let us say we want to measure one more point let us say that is C and that also we are we will try and measure it with respect to A. So we are trying to measure everything with reference to A. So usually this A is known as the benchmark. So all the elevation of points like B, C, D are represented with respect to this with respect to A. So this is known as benchmark or reference datum. Sometimes you will have arbitrary points like this A as benchmark or reference datums and usually what we use as reference datum is your mean sea level. So this mean sea level is nothing but the average level of oceans which is measured over the years and as you can see from the picture here so this sighting happens like this so this is how they sight the leveling staff and you note down the reading here the other surveyor notes down the reading here. And similarly when you want to go this point you just rotate it this side and side the other point wherever it is and note down the staff level reading. With the help of that you can measure this elevation difference. So this is usually helpful in determining the heights like if you want to construct the bridge piers. So for this you will have some design elevations. So with the help of this leveling you can fix those points. And also it will be helpful when you want to measure the height of a tower or if some settlement has happened over the years. In those cases this leveling will be very useful.